N-type and P-type biasing regions by Lawrence Leblanc. We're going to discuss line plots of voltage ranges for both N-type and P-type semiconductors. There are three voltage ranges or biasing regions for both N and P-type, which are accumulation, depletion, and inversion. In accumulation, majority carriers will accumulate near the oxide. As you can see, the majority carrier is a yellow happy face, and the minority carrier is a purple happy face. This demonstration shows how majority carriers accumulate near the oxide interface in accumulation. Next we have depletion, in which majority carriers are lesser at the oxide interface than background doping concentration. And last we have inversion, in which the minority carrier concentration at the oxide interface exceeds majority carrier concentration. Let's have a simple exercise to help us remember. Whether it's N or P, no problem. There were once two girls named Nita and Patty. Patty was P-type. Nita was N-type. Their names were acronyms for the chronological order of their biasing regions. Here is a line plot as VG increases. On the top we will have Nita or N-type and below we shall have Patty or P-type. Distributing the letters of each of their names will help us remember the order of the biasing regions. For N-type we will have inversion, depletion, and accumulation. That would be for our character Nita. For Patty or our P-type semiconductor, the letters of her name spell out to A, D, I for accumulation, depletion, and inversion. I hope this helps your understanding of ideal N and P-type MOS devices. Thank you.